Now, if you're having some issues with your Galaxy Z Flip 6 not connecting to Wi-Fi, I'm going to be going over five different fixes to take care of the problem. Now, the first thing I want you to do is make sure airplane mode isn't turned on. Now, this is a quick setting option on your phone, so sometimes you just tap it. Another thing you could try is toggling the airplane mode to on and off, and sometimes that fixes any connection issues. Okay, the next thing you want to do is go to your Wi-Fi settings and you want to disconnect from the Wi-Fi network you're trying to connect to and then try reconnecting by putting in the password again. Now, if that does not work, I want you to restart your phone and also the router you're trying to connect to. So if this is in your house or somewhere else, give this one a little bit of time before we move on to the next option. Now, the next option would be to go into your reset settings and you want to click on the reset network settings so we could start fresh now you want to make sure not to factory reset your phone here you just want to click on the reset network settings option and if you're still having issues i would recommend seeing if you're due for a software update on your phone you know every once in a while your phone can glitch and a lot of these software updates take care of the problem so if you've been putting them off for whatever reason try updating your phone now the last two things you could do you could try factory resetting your phone or wiping the system cache partition. And to make this happen, you just want to turn your phone off. And when it's completely off, you want to hold the power button and the volume up button simultaneously. Now, when you do this, you want to continue holding both buttons until you see the Samsung logo appear. Continue holding the volume up and it's going to bring you to the Android recovery screen. And this is where you could check out some of those options, like I said, which would be the wipe system cache partition. And then the factory reset would be the last option. Always save that factory reset for last, guys. Don't even mess with it. But anyways, I hope one of these fixes helps you guys out because it's always annoying having Wi-Fi connection issues on any phone you're using. I'd also like to point out you can get on our Take newsletter where we send out one email a week on only the good stuff directly below in the description. As always, thanks for watching this, guys, and we'll see y'all in the next video.